What is up guys? Today I'm going to be doing episode 2 of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. I do appreciate you coming back. Please leave a like and a subscribe if you could. And let's get this game started. After a second day of heavy fighting, US Marines were successfully able to drive North Korean forces out of Seoul. With an additional division arriving soon, hopes are high that we may finally see a return to peace and stability in the region. And that's Why the, is uh, one man spared while another hang taken? On. To this day, I couldn't give you an answer. But death comes for us all. Eventually. When you lose over 6,000 men in four hours, it's easy for one death to become just another number. But all I knew was my best friend was gone, and that part of me wished I had been taken instead. The dead? And they've settled their debts. It's up to the living to pick up the tab. These are some amazing graphics. I'll so have to it say is time that. to say farewell to Private William Robert Irons, a man I had the privilege and honor to have under my command. A life is only important in proportion to its impact on the lives of others. By this standard, Private Irons ranks among one of our very best. Man, that's sad, you know. That's the only bad part about joining the military. There's always a price to pay. He leaves behind family, friends, fellow Marines, and a grateful nation. It's Kevin Spacey. I think his last movie was uh, Horrible Bosses 2. He's a pretty good actor. But man, I'll say this looks pretty realistic. If you've ever seen US Marine dress blues, it looks like... Looks exactly like this, actually. Pay respects to my friend. And my arm is gone. Uh, funerals are never fun. I'm sorry, Mitchell. Will was one of our best. Look, we take care of our own. I know that, Sergeant. Need Excuse me, Private Mitchell. I'm Jonathan Irons. I'm Will's father. Mr. Irons, I'm sorry for your loss, sir. I'm sure you are, Sergeant. Private Mitchell, you were Will's best friend. You both paid too high a price for your country. It was an unfortunate tragedy, sir. It was more than unfortunate, Sergeant. It was unnecessary. Son, I want to offer you a second chance. Mr. Irons, Mitchell's been discharged with his injuries. I'm aware of his injuries, Sergeant. At Atlas, we have prosthetics that are 20 years beyond anything the military could offer you. Will told me what kind of soldier you were. You deserve to fight for a military that's as effective as you are. Think about it. Don't let Will's death be in vain. Hmm. Looks Sorry. impressive. And I guess we'll see how uh, Kevin Spacey turns out as a character. Okay. Everyone knows what to do this time. Get into position. Alright. So we are now in another battlefield. Two on the terrace. Check that. Three. On you, Mitchell. Drop. Got another one. Good kill. Close on the kitchen. Got the silencer in this gun. Definitely helps with a, a stealth mission. Atlas zero one. We are tracking POTUS. Media room south wing. Copy, Prophet. We're internal. Mitchell, toss a threat grenade. <laughs> Ah, uh, you bitch. Clear. And uh, before anything else happens, guys, um, like I said, this is my first time doing walkthroughs, and um, Stack up at the door. I'm actually going to be taking over for Tokyo Blue for the next few weeks, so um, I hope I'm doing okay, and uh, I hope you guys stick Get with me. Charge ready.
Room clear. Mr. President, we're an Atlas rescue force. Can you authenticate? Zulu Tango. Okay, please keep your head down and stay close. All right. Prophet, we have the package. Moving to extract. So we're rescuing the U.S. Copy president. Zero one. Egress to the north access road. Copy that. Fun. Let's get him out of here. This way. We're detecting drones on the back patio. Let them pass. Are we clear? Multiple hostiles by the pool. Drop them. Good stuff. Those grenades, man, I'm telling you. We had those today. Well, it looks like my, uh... Arm is now robotic and now it's malfunctioning slightly. So, we'll see what happens with that. And that was a terrible aim. Go, go! Roger, Roger. Patrol approaching. Get down. Get into the grass, even though it'd Don't still be able to see us very easily. Pass. We're clear. Move on. Shit! Clear them out. Ah! Oh, they saw us. Really? I thought you said we were clear. Yeah, so much for that clear call guy. He got me shot because of that, thanks. Prophet, we're approaching the north access road. What's our exfil status? Transport is coming in hot. ETA, one mic. We're gonna have to dig in until our ride gets here. Hold him off! Grenade. Get the door. Come on. Get it open. Ah. He's got a broken arm. Take a punch to the face. And now the president's dead. Sloppy, Mitchell. You're a dead man. Reset. No excuse for equipment. Okay. Failure. Best weapon you have is the one between your ears. Use it. So that was the whole training module, I guess. Well, that makes it better. The last thing we probably need is the U.S. President dead. That arm's worth more to me than this entire facility. How's my boy doing? He's a work in progress. Well, keep working. This is a great soldier. It's a sad day indeed when the military has no use for good men like you. Jump in. I'll give you the tour. The spacey tour? <laughs> oh, can I get in? Thank you. Joker, we're bringing Mitchell over to R&D. Get the sim prep for another run. You got it, boss. What you're seeing is advanced warfare. 
Atlas has the single largest standing military in the world, but we answer to no country. Unlike the government, we don't keep secrets of our capabilities. We don't sell policy, we sell power. We are a superpower for hire. Power isn't just about the ability to destroy. Atlas has built infrastructures in places like Korea, Sierra Leone, Nigeria. We do in a few years what it takes governments decades to accomplish. In fact, the truth is, we're often more effective than the governments that hire us. As my son found out the hard way. Well, I hope you're right, but uh, it kind of seems like Irons here, or Kevin Spacey, whatever you'd like to call him, is kind of taking his son's death personally, and um, I guess we'll see what happens. Mitchell, I know you're not in this for the money. You remind me a lot of Will in that way. Now go get that arm fixed. Well, thank you, sir. I think. <laughs> All right, over here. Okay. Where are we going, Gideon? Gideon, where are we going? Just taking a shine to you. Don't let it go to your head. Look at me when I'm talking to you, Gideon. Where are we going? We've developed two types of exos: assault and specialist. Each has a primary and secondary ability. Assault is equipped with boost jump as well as sonics for crowd control. The specialist exo you're wearing has a built-in shield in addition to overdrive capability. Technicians are waiting for you. Get that thing fixed up and meet me out here. Sounds like a plan. Hello, Mitchell. Let's see what's going on with that arm. Please, Sounds good, Doc. Over here. Go ahead and place your arm on the table. Looks like I'm getting my robotic arm fixed. Looks well, kind of creepy, actually, but it is what okay. it is. Just gonna run some diagnostics. Try and move your arm for me, please. Making a small adjustment. Hang on. Okay. Again, please. I think I see the problem. <laughs> it's like you see the middle finger come up. One more time, please. All right, you're good. But I recommend some trigger time to check the calibration. Thanks, Doc, but this is going to have to be a free appointment. After all, I should get free stuff for losing my arm. Let's head to the range. He's got the assault exo. Four bastards don't stand a chance. Dr. Chambers, please report the conference room soon. Thank you. Well, besides all the futuristic weaponry, this is actually pretty realistic. You know, the only thing I have a complaint about is games always forget to fix or pay a lot of detail to uh, the eyes of the characters. They always look like they have like doll eyes or dead eyes. Your exo is equipped with overdrive. Use it if you need a tactical advantage. The overdrive battery burns up quick, so use it sparingly. Step up to the station when you're ready. Activating target training. Impressive. Begin round one. Use overdrive. Begin 
begin round two. Okay, so it's gonna get a little harder. Uh, where are my shooting? Use overdrive. This overdrive feature is kinda cool. Begin round three. Hopefully this is the last round. Ah, how did I miss my head? Come on. Use overdrive. Ah, you bastard. Not bad. Hopefully my Training run wasn't complete. awful. Your score was good. Not bad. Okay. Over to the grenade range. You need some hands on with the variable grenades. Boss, we got the sim ready to roll again. Copy. Mitchell and I will be there in a minute. Right, grab some grenades and run the training course. Variable grenades let you switch your grenade type on the fly, depending on the threat. Activate the console. Toss a threat grenade. Shoot through walls to hit those guys. Switch to EMPs to take out drones. Um, as you guys can see, I'm an okay free shooter, but uh, not the best. Toss a smart grenade and aim at a target to guide it. Um. Good. Run it again for a real challenge. Activating grenade training. Well, that's We're pretty embarrassing. <laughs> oh well. Okay. Excel Mark Three demonstration beginning. Now where are we headed? In the atrium. The atrium. What are we running? Another uh, simulation. Stay sharp. Irons is going to be watching. I'm leading this time. Kit up. Reload just to be safe before we do this. Choose your loadout. Right ahead of you. Joker, we're heading up. Switching the sim to assault mode this time. Copy that. We're ready to go. You know, this game's been pretty good so far, so I'm Preparing glad because... Assault mode. I don't know about you guys, Simulation but I thought... Call of Duty Ghosts one, was... Execute. My Not lead. a good game My at all. Take them down. Use overdrive. Atlas zero one. We are tracking coded. Uh. Media room, south wing.
Unload that clip. Yeah, there we go. That's right, bitch. Get it. Let's move on. Move up. All right, pick your entry point. We'll RV at the media room. Let's go through the same entry as last time. Why not, right? No one else? Where are you going? Nowhere, that's where. Nowhere. Mitchell, get to the media room. Whoever may have been there is now dead. Let's do it! That's right. Mr. President, we're here to rescue you. Need your authentication code. Hmm. Alpha, Zulu, Tango. This is a pretty Confirm. nice bathroom. Stay behind us. Let's move. Atlas zero one, be advised. Doesn't look much like mine, but uh. QRF approaching your position. Copy that. It's not Prophet. bad. You know, actually, where I live in New England. Use your EMPs. We are finally uh getting some weather that worth um going outside for it's been snowing for the past few weeks and it's been cold as hell so i'm glad it's been warming up because i really need it actually i don't want to throw this can i put it back there you go assault drone what is this? It's looks like that toy you can buy from GameStop. Oh. Okay. It's no toy, apparently. I'm gonna go with the machine gun. This is pretty awesome, though. That's right. Area's clear. Keep moving. And um, you know, guys, there's uh, obviously go, full go. walkthroughs up of this game already because it came out a while ago. But um, I hope I'll make my videos exciting enough so you guys can stick here and uh, enjoy the ride. You know. Profit, we're approaching the north access road. Need immediate exfil. Copy that, Atlas 01. Did I just run out of stamina? Kind of looks like I did. Get the president inside. Do it right this time. Come on, Mr. President. This is first class for you. ATV 1. Profit. Package is secure. Copy, Atlas 01. Warbird inbound to yeah, provide air support. That's a pretty EPA bad joke. By the way. Alright, dig in. Thank you much. Get to the chopper! Get to the wall, Looks like
think we have an operator on our hands. He's getting there, sir. He's ready for some real work. Good job, son. Welcome to Atlas. Good to be here, sir. So that's going to be the end of episode 2 guys I hope you enjoyed it and please come back and join me again for episode 3 of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare <laughs>